in a bid to overcome insecurity in the African continent and upsurge in coups in Africa. President Uhuru Kenyatta last evening called for collaboration between the United Nations, the African Union and the regional economic blocs in the renewal of African security architecture. The president said the solidarity and cooperation between the various institutions would help the continent to overcome the various challenges facing it, among them insecurity, COVID-19, and effects of climate change. So rainfall, that amount of rainfall will probably create flooding. Speaking while he chaired a virtual United Nations Security Council high-level debate on cooperation between the United Nations, regional and sub-regional organizations with a special focus on the African Union. The head of state called for a rethinking of peacekeeping in Africa, noting that for the efforts to be effective, synchrony between continental responses and the United Nations peacekeeping missions and call for more inclusivity. At the same time, the head of state decried the reason upsurge in coups in Africa, saying they have caused insecurity and instability on the continent. <laughs> on climate change, President Uhuru Kenyatta said African countries should embrace green investments in sectors such as renewable energy. The president added that the forthcoming United Nations Climate Change Conference in Glasgow, Scotland, should produce tangible and transformative investments in climate adaptation that will allow for strong green growth in Africa. Speaking during the meeting, United Nations Deputy Secretary General Amina Mohammed called for global solidarity and support in accelerated access to COVID-19 vaccines by African countries, strengthening of health systems and more investments in pandemic preparedness. Angela Cherur, K24 TV, Nairobi.